Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys how to use the scissors tool inside of uh, Logic Pro. Uh, this is very, very easy. Uh, it's a very simple lesson. I just want to show the beginners and new users to uh, to uh, Logic Pro how to basically do this. Comes in handy when you're breaking apart uh, <clears throat> audio files. You simply uh, you can either do it in this screen or you can do it in the edit screen. It's sim it's better to do it in the edit screen because everything's amplified. Uh, we're going to click on the tools. We're going to go down to Scissors Tools. A pair of scissors is going to pop up. And you're basically just going to snip, or it basically uh, acts like you're snipping through paper. So wherever you want to point uh, point your scissors and uh, click, it snips it and it turns into, uh, makes it its own audio file. So you can snip it however many times you want. Uh, it's, it's good for uh, breaking apart audio tracks. Let's say you guys record something cool and you guys like only a couple parts in it. You uh, Let's say uh, this is the audio file. You know, you like the first four takes. You don't like the next four takes. You basically snip right in the middle like I just did. Uh, and you hit delete and, it, and you get rid of it. Very easy. Uh, and I hope um, I, I taught some of you guys uh, a new lesson. It comes in handy. Uh, I suggest it. I use it all the time. Uh, thank you guys for watching my video, and I and I hope I tell you guys something. Take care, and please subscribe.